Hey, we are back with another review, and today we got some pickups from GameStop. We got two identically sized boxes right here sitting, chilling on the table that are just full of pops. So without further ado, let's hop right into this review and let's see what we got from GameStop. As you can see, the box on the right has a bit of a crunch in it. We're gonna see what the heck we got inside here first. I think I'm gonna scoot this other one off to the side for now. And we're gonna hop into this one and we're gonna see what the heck we got inside here. And hopefully nothing is damaged. Now I've been ordering like crazy from GameStop. Every week I'm you play for some one, two, or three orders from GameStop trying to grab all the stuff that they're that they're dropping. And GameStop seems to be the best place for me personally to buy my pops from. I think I have some kind of local distribution going on here because no joke i get like one to two day shipping on this stuff like one of these boxes today's sunday when i'm recording this particular pickup video but i ended up ordering one of these boxes on friday and it's here today so yeah pretty freaking sweet and actually this is the, this is my order from friday so you can see what i ordered two days ago here you go check it out so here we go let's pull the first pop out which isn't in this order but is still mint so this is why i think that there is some kind of local distribution here because the way that the pops are put in this box it's almost like they did it at a store and someone just personally drove it over to my house which is what i've been seeing on at least the doorbell cam is that it's basically a random person every time they're not in a company vehicle and they're just dropping my stuff off i mean like i said this one showed up on my doorstep this morning before 9 a.m it was sitting there chilling waiting for me which is pretty cool. We got Johnny Lawrence from the Cobra Kai set. We have um, Daniel LaRusso already. These are two pops, which at first it was very, very bizarre. Uh, I thought maybe PPG or somebody got confused over there and they crossed the original wave with this wave and there was some kind of crossover, but apparently this price is actually staying on these and they're fairly high. They're still for sale. If you can find them on certain websites, I mean, you can find them on the shelves of certain stores, but they're hitting like 30, 40 bucks each for LaRusso's a little bit more than Johnny Lawrence. But from this particular set, the, the Cobra Kai set, they dropped Johnny Lawrence and Daniel LaRusso, which is really cool. And uh, it's gonna be a nice little photo op getting these two together. But uh, yeah, we'll probably check those out in a separate video. We'll probably review both of them together. I'm gonna put him off over here. Let's pull out some of these sorters and then get this box off the table. Now, the nice thing about GameStop sorters is they don't have the name on the outside, so you don't actually know what pop is what, which is cool. And then, you know what we're gonna do? Since these are in sorters, I'm gonna slice open this other box, and we're gonna take a look at what we got in this one, too. And we're just gonna pop sorters. We're gonna do it like that mystery box style if you would all right so we got more air air bubbles we got some sorters in here how many sorters we got in this one four or five looks like we got five in here so we got five sorters so we got nine pops ten pops we got nine pops in this trip pretty good so this was i think the order i placed on like tuesday or something Right here, let's get this, let's get these air pillows in here and let's get this box out of play. If you would, we're gonna get this and just drop it right over there. So we got Johnny Lawrence. We're gonna put Johnny Lawrence right up there. And we're just gonna start popping sorters here. Let's see what we ended up getting in this particular sorter. We'll, uh... Oh, nice, we got our Fast Times from Richmond High. Let's see if we can slide this out. We got Jeff Spigoli here with the trophy. <laughs> really cool. Here's the wave right there. You got Spigoli with the pizza box. You got Barrett. You got Brad Hamilton. You got Mr. Hand right there with a slice of pizza. Really cool wave here. Great movie. Fast Times at Richmond High is iconic for sure. Love my 80s movies. Love collecting the people pops from the 80s movies. We got Stripes coming up here soon. Fast Times at Richmond High. They dropped this June, I believe, when these became live on the GameStop site. Again, GameStop dropping that fire. They ship their stuff in sorters. You see in the pillows in there. Sorters with the pillows. Pops always arrive mint. I mean, I couldn't I couldn't say enough how much I've had a positive experience ordering from GameStop. It's probably one of the only companies I consistently have positive experiences when I order collectibles from. 
I've had no issues. I know people love to rag on GameStop. I can't find anything bad to say about them except for the fact that their their own branded pop protectors are garbage. That's that's it, and that's all I got. I mean, that's the only thing I got in the arsenal. So we got Jeff Spicoli with the trophy. Let's grab another one. Let's see what we got in this one. Let's see which one. What pop did we get today? Nice. We got our Funko Insider Club. Terrell over here. Look at this Diablo. Oh, man. This is sick. Look at that artwork on the back. This is a nice pickup here. Now, I believe this pop dropped in some kind of bundle um, with, like, a Handsome Jack. There was a bunch of pops they dropped. And then they started launching these individually. And then I saw this one launch individually. I said, I'm scooping that one up for sure. Um, I don't have the actual Diablo pop, but Diablo was a game that I definitely played back in the day for sure. This character, I'm not too familiar with exactly who this particular character is because again Diablo 1 after Diablo 1 it kind of went towards this like MMO type of route um and again I like the single multiplayer experience so uh, in the beginning you basically you were picked a class of a character you fought Diablo and at the end of Diablo you basically got the soul stone put in your head and then you became Diablo I guess <laughs> and then you made they made Diablo 2 and then Diablo 3 and then there's like Diablo Lord of Destruction and then yeah but um Diablo is a really cool game franchise for sure it was one of the first uh like I guess online games that I was able to actually get into in the 90s that was after Doom it was like Warcraft 2 uh playing online with that with Battle.net same thing with Diablo um it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool back in the day. So I ended up scooping up this pop, and it's going to be nice to pop this one out the box and check it out. So Funko Insider Club, uh, Terrell, Terrell, whatever. You let me know down in the comments below how to say that. So we got another sorter here. What do we got in this one? Let's pop this up and slide it out. We got, oh, nice. We got one of our Archie pops showed up. So we got Archie Andrews from the Archie line this is the pop comics archie this isn't the riverdale archie <laughs> this is going to be the wave right here we got archie andrews veronica lodge jughead jones and betty cooper now i don't know if they're going to drop any like um convention exclusives down the road we still have nycc coming up nothing from archie cobra kai fast times um have been released yet for any type of special stickered ones coming up in the future but I imagine they might do something maybe for at least maybe the Cobra Kai. But I don't know. Maybe they'll do something with Archie uh, coming up this year. They usually end up dropping waves of pops throughout the year. And if they do an exclusive like a con one, they'll usually drop it within that year. So pretty cool on that. We got Archie Andrews. Let's grab one of these over here and see what we got here. Let's see what we got. What's in the box? Oh, sick. Okay, cool. So we got our Stark tech suit Hulk here from the Avengers game. Love me some Hulk pops. Hulk's probably one of my favorite Marvel, I guess, Avengers characters, definitely. He's definitely my favorite Avenger. I'd say Hulk, Bruce Banner for sure. Um, but I'd say like Venom's probably my favorite character. But Hulk is sick. And when you get Hulk and Venom together, you get Venomized Hulk. And then you get one of my favorite pops. So uh, I like the Hulk characters. I like the classic Hulk characters. Um, not too fond of the MCU Hulks, and when I saw that this one was dropping, which isn't an MCU Hulk, and it isn't a classic comic Hulk, it's a video game Hulk, which is really cool, and I have the exclusive from Walmart of this one, where he's painted in the war paint with the skull and the white uh, tribal paint on him, but in this particular common, he is, he's in the tech suit, which is pretty cool. This is a cool pop, and I'm glad that this one came from GameStop, because I've seen these on the shelf, and they've been pretty... They've been pretty handled, let's just say that. Let's grab another one from over here. What do we got in this particular box here? Oh, nice. My Halloween pops are starting to show up. Check it out. We got, what is this? Uh, it was, I don't, it was, had a special name. It was like Wicked Mickey or something like that. It was like Wicked Mini, Wicked, Wicked Mickey and Witchy Mini, I believe. But anyway, we got vampire mickey that's pretty dang cool right there from the pop disney line number 795 795 disney pops uh, i do like me some classic mickey mouse and man when i saw that they were dropping some halloween pops in july i said boom we're grabbing those for sure we got halloween mickey right there i'm ready for halloween i don't know about you guys halloween is basically the kickoff 
for the holiday season. So as soon as we get to that point, hopefully everything that we've experienced thus far just gets swept behind us and we can move forward from all of this because it is we're living in some interesting times. Let's just say that. So let's see what we got on this particular. Ah, uh, here we go. We wouldn't have we wouldn't have it any other way without the matching set. We got Minnie Mouse here, Witchy Minnie. She's riding on her broom right there, which is really cool. We got seven ninety six in the Pop Disney line. Superb pop. It's got that grayscale with the orange accents. Beautifully done for the Halloween season. We got that nice Halloween backdrop. This was when I saw these. I said I'm scooping these up. There's tons of pops dropping right now. We're about to hit SDCC. Uh, well, with this video being recorded, SDCC is next week. So, but. Uh, I was, I'm still over here picking up Halloween pops in July, so yeah, that's pretty cool. I'm glad I was able to scoop up Mickey and Minnie, uh, the Halloween style ones. Those are, those are super sick. And plus we got the Marvel Zombies line dropping here next week as well, which is also, they're dropping 10 inch thing during the, uh, the con, which is going to be, it's a, some mind blowing stuff's getting dropped this this week from Funko. Funko's been, I mean, they've been killing it. The past year, past the past year, they've been dropping some pretty fire stuff. And when you compare, like I do, the newer stuff to the older stuff, you can definitely tell how the company's been growing and how they've how they've not only been listening to the people that buy their products, but they've also been um, taking the uh, level of detail to the next level, which is which is something you want from. I mean, these are these are clearly toys and collectibles for adults for sure and they know who they're catering to they pick the right they pick the right pops to make i mean they're making spigoli pops from fast times rich my high you think you think somebody under the age of 25 is buying this pop and knows what the heck's going on i mean half the people didn't even watch this thing when uh when they were a kid um you know what i'm saying they were too busy playing with their ipads but this is some classic 80s fire right here and then cobra kai the relaunching of the Karate Kid, one of the most famous movies of all time. I mean, they know who their market is, that's for sure. And speaking of knowing your market, we got the Creep Show Creep. Now, I don't know familiar with the new Creep Show series that they have on Shudder, but the Creep is an icon for sure. If you watch George Romero's Creep Show, you know that this Creep with the Creep Show book is the icon from. Uh, 80s horror i mean george romero made some of the best horror movies ever made and this is probably i guess as close as i'm going to get to getting a george romero movie pop so uh creep show it is we got the creep this is an awesome pickup so we got one more pop here in the sorter and off the top of my head i can't think of which one i'm missing here but now actually i do know which one i'm missing let me now that i just looked at what it is let's see we got we got spicoli with the pizza box this is Spicoli, Jeff Spicoli with the pizza box right there. He's got his classic Vans on. He's got that old surfer dude um, pullover on right there with the pocket. I mean, this is this is great. Seeing the, these 80s pops starting to roll in. And next we got Linda Barrett. We got Brad Hamilton and Mr. Hand waiting on for those to come in. And then the rest of the wave for Archie to come in. So um, they do ship things in kind of piecemeal. And I try to... I kind of thought maybe all those would be in these two boxes, but again, some of the stuff ships super fast, some of the stuff gets broken up, and like I said, I think maybe GameStop has some kind of distribution thing going on here where you know, they're basically pulling these pops from the stores and then packaging them up and dropping them off and shipping them, or I should say just moving them across the, the city to whoever bought it. Because uh, like I said, some of the stuff comes super quick. We're talking next day, um, delivery on some of these things and then some of them are taking a little bit longer which i imagine maybe those might ship from gamestop directly i don't know i, I putting a method to the madness is, is beyond me right now i just know i got some pretty cool pops on the table here and we're going to do a little quick review of everything that we ended up getting here we ended up getting the creep from creep show the new shutter series but still the old because it says pop television uh, but still the creep from the classic movie both of them pretty cool pop to get right there we got stark tech suit game reverse hulk archie andrews from the archie comic line right there classic not riverdale Terrell, 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 whatever funko insider club diablo pop pretty dang cool probably gonna grab the actual diablo pop 
I actually probably would like that more than that one, but again, that's a that's a pretty cool pop and definitely something worth hanging on to from the Pop Games line. If you slept on that pop, you better go back and grab it because that's a pop that you're not going to want to get down the road. We got Jeff Spicoli with the Pizza Box classic scene from the movie Fast Times at Richmond High. We got Jeff Spicoli with the trophy from the dream sequence in the movie. Amazing. We got Johnny Lawrence from the new rendition of the YouTube series. Again, my first YouTube series pop is the Cobra Kai series. That's pretty cool. Uh, I know they dropped some other, you know, they dropped like Ninja, but Cobra Kai. That's the first YouTube series pops they've dropped. And we got Johnny Lawrence from that. That's pretty cool. And then we got our two Halloween pops. We got Witchy Minnie and uh, Spooky Mickey, I think is what it was. I don't know what the, uh, the official name was, but it just says Minnie and Mickey Mouse on there. So we're going to go with that for now. So why don't you let me know down in the comments below, what do you think of this GameStop haul? What, which one of these pops was your favorite pop from this pickup? And uh, yeah, if you like this video, why don't you give it a thumbs up? And if you want more content like this, subscribe for more because I do reviews every single day. So look out for that and have a great rest of your day.